hey guys welcome back to next gen blog and in this video i want to show you how you can apply zigzag movements to a video in vstc pro version now it's actually super easy to apply zigzag movements to a video in vstc pro so without further delay let's get started and see how you can do this now to demonstrate this, I've already imported a demo video in the editor. So this is my demo video present right here. And the first thing which you need to do is you need to double click on your video. Next, you need to go to video effects, go to transforms, select shift and now click on OK. Now currently the duration of the shift effect is the entire duration of my demo video in the timeline that is 9 seconds to 66 milliseconds. So I would like to reduce the duration of my shift effect to 6 seconds. So inside the duration option you need to write 06.000 and then press enter on the keyboard. Now look inside the shift settings which is present inside the properties window. And inside the shift settings, you will find two options, X shift levels and Y shift levels. Now, currently the value inside Y shift levels is 100 pixel. So you need to delete this value and instead of 100, you need to write 0 and then press enter on the keyboard. Now click on X shift levels and if you look on the extreme right of X shift levels, you are going to find these three dots which are present right here. So click on these three dots and the moment you click on these three dots, this graph is going to open up. Now if you look right here, you are going to find this templates option. So click on this templates option and if you look right above, you are going to find this templates section. Now inside this templates section, we have our zigzag movements. So we have four different zigzag movements which we can apply on top of our video. So they are named zigzag 1, zigzag 2, zigzag 3 and zigzag 4. And we are going to try out all these zigzag movements one by one. So first let me just select zigzag 1. Now the moment you click on zigzag 1, this template settings dialog will open up. You simply need to click on OK. And so now let me just quickly play the video for you. So this is the first zigzag movement. Perfect. Let me just quickly play the video for you once again. All right. Now I would like to show you the next zigzag movement but before I do that first I would like to reset my graph. So to reset the graph you simply need to write the value 100 inside X shift levels. So delete all the values which are present inside X shift levels and then write 100 and then press enter on the keyboard and this will reset your graph. Now go to templates option once again and select zigzag 2 and inside template settings dialog click on the OK button and now let me just play the video for you. So this is the second zigzag movement. So let me just play the video for you once again. All right. Okay. Now let me just reset my graph once again. So inside X shift levels, let me just write the value 100 and now press enter on the keyboard. Now go to templates option once again and now let me just select zigzag 3. And inside template settings, let me just click on the OK button. And let me just play the video for you. So this is the third zigzag movement. Perfect. 
let me play the output for you once again all right now let me reset my graph by writing 100 pixel inside the x shift levels option and now go to templates option once again and this time select zigzag 4 and inside template settings dialog click on ok and let me play the video for you so this is the fourth zigzag movement so you can use any of this zigzag movements in your video one another thing which i would like to tell you is that you can use this zigzag movements in your text as well as in your image so basically you can use all these four zigzag movements in your video in your text as well as in your image so this is how you can apply different zigzag movements to a video in vstc pro version do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching